All right, all right, all right. Welcome back, everybody. We are on the gift of Caucasus, and we are harvesting carrots, as you can see. We are on field 13. Uh, he's about halfway done. With the carrots, we have, I think I planted barley over on that side again. Yeah. And we, if you recall, in the last episode, Field 5 came up for sale for $704,000. And the nominal value was seven forty. dollars So that was a good deal. I couldn't decide if I wanted to buy it. It's a little far away from the farm but it's a huge field you know it's it's every bit as big as, as field number nine and I don't know why we didn't have to be uh, a rating of 40 to buy that one I, I don't understand but anyhow we are a rating of 32 we bought field number five I figured uh, as much as the map has beat us up that that was a bit of a gift so while it's not exactly where we wanted to be uh, location wise at this point if uh, if we could acquire field number six and once we're level rating 40 by field number nine then we do kind of have everything all stacked in a row there you know there's field number seven over there, there you know not so bad I don't think so yeah I planted uh, I planted canola in it the whole dang thing I'm not really sure why but uh, we needed some canola we were pretty low we only had like 50,000 so I thought that would fill us up pretty good and it was uh, easy to, to just throw that in there and get it planted without uh, much thought and get something in there. However, I think a field that size is going to force us to finally, uh, we're going to have to upgrade on our, on our harvester I think. Well I don't think, I know because you know that's a, that's a huge field and we're just going to have to we're going to have to bite the bullet and and get us a big a big harvester which is fine i think it's a, it's about time for that i think we're doing pretty good we're moving right along so i don't mind you know we can we can take a loan out and uh probably get the the big case and get that going and you know we can always use the the tracked one for uh, sunflowers and corn and uh, maybe we'll do our big grains up on the the big field uh, up there on field five I don't, I don't really have it the new plan uh, all mapped out just trying to keep something in the field I know I had said uh, I think in the last video that I was gonna start selling anything over a hundred thousand but of course a contract came up for uh, 150,000 of sunflower, and uh, I didn't have that. I didn't have anywhere close to that. Um, what do we have? We only have, let's see. Yeah, we only had like 75,000 sunflower, so that's why I just went ahead and threw canola in there. We got barley. We're working down the list trying to keep everything well over uh, 100,000, I guess. So. You know, sunflower, rye, oats. Uh, we're gonna be in pretty good shape with the with the carrot and onions. But some of the grains that we did on our first round through of planting, you know, we're gonna need some more of those. But uh, yeah, that's where we're at. Um, let's see. We got this guy cultivating down on field 18 not sure what I'm gonna do down there yet I thought maybe we would uh, maybe potatoes we could rotate potatoes and sugar beets way down here in this area since this field is kind of uh, 
stranded off on its own? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. But we can probably. Well, we can get these guys. Uh, unstuck. So the good news is that we got uh, two bunkers in the BGA here to unload, so that should give us a little bit of money. But, you know, we might still just jump right out and, and get the loan and, and get the case. It's probably ready to harvest up there. seems like, uh, well, not quite. So we got some time yet before we need to get up there. So, that being said, we can probably sell some milk. Um, let's see, I don't, I don't know how much we got, but more importantly, let's see who's, who's buying. Bakery's not. Dairy factory could take a little. Hmm. I figured, uh, well, we'll go ahead and send a load. It's been a couple days since we, uh, since we sold any milk, so I figured maybe they would be ready, but... Hey, we're gonna need to try and find... figure out something else, uh... that we can sell. this guy situated right clearly you couldn't get lined up with the harvester on the corner there so we're getting straightened out here a little bit come on now don't knock us over where you going buddy all right Find your way back in, or what? Okay. Like that a little better, apparently. All right. Super sensitive today, he is. All right. Yeah, we'll send this guy down to the uh, dairy factory and go ahead and take what we can get from him. I wonder if we shouldn't sell maybe what about if we would sell let's see we got a lot of sugar beets sugar refineries buying sugar beets maybe we should sell some of those I think that's what we're gonna do I wonder where is the sugar Oh, that's not even very far, is it? He's, he's right over by the BGA. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to 
set up a course to do that real quick, I think. Let's see what we got here. Is he going to tell us? Why is he not telling me? Forage. Onion. that gate opens uh, inward. Not sure why. didn't want to let us delete any more than that. We'll see if it'll work. So yeah, we'll see if we can find our way down to the sugar refinery. Maybe we can make a little bit of money uh, selling some sugar beets. We don't need to get rid of a ton of them, but we do have quite a few and I think maybe down on that field 18 down there we might just do a rotation of sugar beets and potatoes we can just keep our uh, equipment for that our harvester is down there it's not a big deal to run a cedar down there That's the, the clean way out of the farm. There's no mud puddles when you go that way. So the first one here is the cement factory. So we know that's not it. The second one is the railroad. So that's not it the railroad yard here so here or up there or is that how we get into up there let's pause and oh, I think that's that's how we get in and Let's 
get out and take a look around real quick. Place for sugar filling. That's not us. There's a coin around here somewhere. Hear it? Here we go. This looks like where uh somewhere around here. Maybe over on this side. Unload sugar beets. All right. Okay, so should be able to just head on around this way. Monday. It's pretty cool. That's uh, that's all animated there. Loading them up the into the elevator there. Find our way back out of here. set this guy up then and let him do a couple of runs and yeah I feel like we're getting along in this map a little bit now. I feel good after buying Field 5, like, you know, we can start investing into some uh, some larger equipment, at least on the... Uh, I, did, I did look around and I was able to find a larger uh, multi-fruit cedar that'll do the carrots and onions. Uh, so we can get away from just the three meter seed. We will be stuck on three meter harvest with those, but you know, that's okay. That's what we got to work with. So at least we can get them, uh, the fields planted a little quicker. I think that will, that'll help. Alright, and we are going to stop there. Say so eats at sugar refinery. All right, and we're going to say load some sugar beets. First waypoint, see if he loads up. All right, he's loading that trailer. Let's see, if, or the bed. Let's see if he'll load the trailer. I'm going to go with no, but we'll see. Oh, look at that! All right, and then let's 
see our other guy. This guy. We'll just go ahead and stop him. Turn him off. Let's see what this guy's got going on. What? You know how many runs he's made here? And we have not had a problem with that. Okay. Where are you going, buddy? Really? Good? Alright. This guy's done. So this field is ready to be fertilized. Action. Oh, let's see. Ooh, look out. Doing a little half pipe action there. We can just go ahead. This guy's still sitting in the field over here. He's got quite a bit of juice in him still. Okay. Man, I'm squishing stuff. Should be able to just run him down to field 18 and, and get him going. And then we can think about uh, what we want to do to the plant down there. I could, I could probably put the potato seeder on the back of the cloth here go ahead and, and get him going. Everything's pretty much planted up. Probably use the John Deere to do uh, to plant the carrot field if we would need to. Let's see. We should have a course for him already. Field 18 spray. Field 18 refill first. Try first waypoint. Go ahead and be on your way. Click over to this guy. And you know what? I think we'll just go ahead and load, set him up with the potato seeder. Which is going to take a ton of seeds. So, I need to get the other guy going to buy seeds, too. Might as well get it going. Why not? You can always sell off the potatoes at the cannon factory or wherever I'll buy them. Got the guy selling sugar beets, so... Oh, 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 what's this? What's this? Okay, potatoes, 38, so 4,000 potatoes at the port. Okay, 4,000 potatoes at the port. I hope our guy gets back pretty quick. Where's he at? Alright, we're just going to ride with him because we're going to need to... We're gonna need to run some potatoes down to the port. We need the uh, we need the rating um, the rating bonus. Doesn't pay very good. It's only four thousand liters of potatoes, but we need to we need to complete the uh, mission. Yeah, that'll give us uh, another rating point. 
which is just about our highest uh, priority right now because sooner we the higher we can get our rating the, the more options we have on this map so so hopefully we oh too fast too fast hopefully we got enough uh, we should have enough time to get down there we're almost back up here already say it was 4,000. Hope that's right. We are loaded up. We will run. Let's see. I wonder if we can sneak out this way without getting too dirty. We're going to we're going to give it a try. It's about the the Massey's not done. get on to just the outside of the headlights. We'll worry about him when we get back. If I can remember, yeah, to get to the port, we just need to across the bridge here and head left. I'm not sure where we sell potatoes there, but I'm sure we can figure it out. Doesn't seem like these uh, quick deliveries or even the contracts come up very often. Seems like you only get about one, maybe two a day at best, unless I've been missing them. I do uh, sometimes let course play run and you know, mow the VGA and, and go off and, and do stuff around the house, but I don't know. They don't come up very often, I guess is my point. It doesn't seem like it, so I'm trying to really jump on them uh, any chance that I can. is where is that, that way over there that would be weird hopefully we don't blow it driving around down here There's the green. Condensed milk, that's not it. the other side of the green that's a milk or tank or something or other one that's, that's logs in it wood that's where we buy cement there, huh? And is there even anything out 
here. Holy crap, there's not. That don't. Alright. The other way when we come in the, the front gate there. Oh, I sure didn't see anything down here. Guys aren't yelling at the T yelling at your yelling at your screen going, you dummy, you passed it up. <laughs> it's possible, but because that's the green. Looks like sand and gravel over there. There, where'd that go? Right there. I guess it's potato or vegetable. We're about to find out. Potatoes are a vegetable. Paid much money, but we should be 33. Yep. Woo. All right. We'll run this guy. Let's see. Well, let's see what's going on with these guys here. going crazy here now. Come on now. truck. See if we can get him back up to uh, selling some sugar beets. Look at that, we got 212000 in the bank already. And I don't even owe the bank any money. So we'll be on our way to getting a harvester here pretty quick. be able to make some upgrades to uh, some substantial upgrades to our equipment pretty quick you know when we're used to saving up six seven hundred eight hundred thousand to buy a field uh, you know get a big harvester I guess the other thing that would be nice would be to get the uh, the Tektron and the Maxtron. You're looking at a million there, but you know maybe if we can get some of these uh, 
other fruits in storage we can <clears throat> sell off some of those like we are with the sugar beets and that'll help uh, finally get a little bit more of a supplement to our income out of the fields which would be awesome because I feel like we've been busting our butt working on the fields and, and really uh, not getting a whole lot of return out of it at this point alright let's see we can hit this guy here see if he's going to load up and continue on I guess I could have got him a little bit closer I don't even remember how much the case is but it seems like we need about a half a mil to get that rig to get the the harvester and the header for it he's going to drive right by I don't know why it does that but sometimes it does when you start the course for the first time so That was like uh, good luck. Maybe we'll have a contract pop up here since we sent this guy out to sell some stuff. Alright, there he goes. Let's, we can take a look at, man, yeah, we went we, 380. Okay, and the header is, is that, no, it's this one, so 380 and 80, yeah, that's the one we want, right? So yeah, we're looking at, we're looking at 460, so. wonder if we shouldn't just, uh, I don't think, I do have the class, but I don't like that one too much. We do have the Neva. That's not a big one though. I've used, I don't know about the John Deere's. I think for our main one, we're just going to go with uh, and let's see, what did I say we needed for 460? So we need to have about let's say 500 Dude, right? 9230. Yeah. Yeah. And then we'll go ahead and get our header. This guy. about this one. Hold on, let's get him in the... Uh, let's get him into the harvester group here, which is six. What I like about this one, more so, A, it's big. 
but I like that the header has the the cart built right in. You don't gotta dork around with trying to get uh, trying to get that up onto a header trailer, which can be a ridiculous pain in the rear end. Although on this map it seems like we would have plenty, plenty of room to maneuver around, but if we get a secondary one, maybe we'll get uh, a modded one or something, maybe one of the John Deere's, or maybe the little Neva. I don't, uh, I don't know how big the heads are for that one. Maybe we could get that as to do our corn and sunflower or something like that, but it's hard to go wrong with the case with the uh, the header that you can tow right behind. Are we... Yeah, we could start harvesting up there. We'll have to get us a... Uh, we'll have to get us a tipper up there. gotten stuck there's a big mud puddle when you go up the side of the farm and climb the steep hill on the non-paved road there's a big giant mud puddle just on the other side of the milk pickup the milk trigger I got the the class stuck in there as well as the Hurley moon so I'm a little we got and we got barley ready to harvest there. I'm a little nervous about or look I shouldn't say nervous isn't the right word. I'm a little I wonder if we can't cut right up through here. I'm a little unsure. about doing the tipper courses through that mud puddle if they're going to keep getting stuck their low horse horsepower tractors and this is a little back door right here so maybe we will run them up and up and out of here I kind of like that I think we're going to do that see what the Ford's got going on here real quick. Okay, we should be able to just stop this guy. Alright. And let's see if we can't get this guy going set up and then we might get him started and I think that might be uh, I think that might be it for this episode we might even be already already be over the half hour mark I can't I don't remember Okay, so let's see. We are maybe on field work. We are on field five. What is that? Thirteen point two. Okay, we're going to start on southeast, 
We're going to go west. We're going to bring it back. We're going to do two headlands. There's a tree somewhere. So we're going to do two headlands. We're going to do them... Um, yeah, that way, but we're going to do the... Uh, no, we are going to do that. Nope. Yep. I'm going to say F5 harvest 13.2 meters with the case. And that would be my doll. Knows what she saw going down the street. Alright, we're going to get this guy going and I'll get a tipper up here uh, off camera. And we'll get going on getting us some canola. And uh, yeah, hope you guys are enjoying the series on this map. Uh, I sure am enjoying playing this map. If you are enjoying the series, uh, please consider giving us a like. It helps the channel out quite a bit. And uh, better yet, uh, subscribe to the channel. You'll be notified uh, if we do uh, a live stream or uh, when we post some new videos. But, uh, yeah, I'm your host, Zigzaggy. And we will see you on the farm next time.